What's up everybody, this is Edmund Lowe here and I'm honoured to do this uh, OnPay.my step-by-step tutorial and if you are not aware what OnPay.my is, it's basically a local payment processor here in Malaysia where you can receive payments and even uh, do an affiliate program. So if you're selling digital products such as ebooks, software, memberships, and uh, even if you're doing live events uh, or even e-commerce for that matter, I think this is going to be a very useful solution for receiving payments as a gateway. All right. Now, reason why I do this tutorial, even though there is clearly an FAQ about it, is because if you check this out, like the FAQ or even the, the tutorials for the matter, you're going to notice that uh, number one, uh, it's only available in Bahasa Malaysia, and uh, no offense, even as of the time of this video, I find that. Uh, a lot of the training here or, or the, the steps here are let's just say it could have been arranged somewhat better you know like topic 1 to 12 is kind of like a, a little vague right now uh, even the uh, FAQ as well but um, that doesn't detract from the fact that I find onpay.my to be uh, a rather stable platform it's got good support and as a beginner you can start for free which I'm going to show you how to open an account in a while and uh, you can choose to upgrade afterwards, which is exactly what I did. There are several packages that you can choose from. I will talk about it afterwards. And uh, this will be the first of the several step-by-step -step tutorial on how to use OnPay.my so you can start accepting payments online, from, whether it's from your own website or even to use their built-in form, which I think is pretty amazing. I've seen some sellers that don't even have a website. They just use OnPay.my and do business. So I think it's a very versatile platform. They even have a Facebook group and I find it to be supportive as well. Uh, but just bear in mind that the main language here is in Bahasa Malaysia. So if your Bahasa Malaysia is a little bit rusty, then it's time to like kind of brush it up, okay? But um, I find it to be a friendly community in my own experience. And uh, let's not waste any time rambling. Let's just jump right into it, okay? Now, I already have an account with them. Right now I have one main account. And uh, to get started, all you need to do is just click on um, this red button here called Daftar Pachuma, which means register for free. All right. Uh, let's just go there. And now this step is pretty much self-explanatory. Uh, I'm just going to give you a quick rundown. So subdomain, basically, I, I think this is going to be a fixed one. So make sure that this domain is something that you're going to stick with. Okay, this is a subdomain. Um, I call mine musemancer.onpay.my, so that's the name of my company. Now, if you don't have a company name, you're not sure what you want to call it, you can even call it after your personal name. That's not, that's no right or wrong, so don't overthink this part, okay? So maybe I'll just, for the fun of it, I'll just call it edmundlow.onpay.my, that's my name, all right? Email, this will be your main email address, so uh, maybe this would be my main email address, all right? Um, ID admin, this would be your username, so... Just for consistent reasons, I like to put my ID name and my subdomain name the same. It's But there's no right or wrong, okay? Uh, put in your password. I'm not going to actually register, by the way, because I already have an account, but I'm just showing you the steps, all right? And uh, name, your full name, or even your first name and last name. Okay, you can put in your, uh, your phone number, but of course, make sure it's a proper phone number. Uh, gender, your date of birth. All right, and then you tick this box, I agree to the terms and conditions, and uh, recapture, just tick this, I am not a robot, and just click DAFTA, which means register. And uh, you're pretty much done, all right? Now, again, I'm not going to actually do this because I already have an account with them. I don't have any intentions of creating another new account, but what you can expect after this is that you will probably be asked to check your inbox, which is your email address, for an email confirmation so that you need to verify this account. And once you're done, you can then log in. So how you can log in afterwards is that you can go to onpay.my, you go to the top rightmost, which is called log masok or login. You click on that, and you'll be asked for your subdomain, your username, and then your password. Okay, and then you click on the blue button log masok, which means login, and you'll be in. All right. So now, depending on the version of your account, you'll probably see a bit less features as a new account. And as a brand new account, you're not going to see anything here. It's probably going to be written all zeros and all that. Um, nothing wrong with that. I mean, I registered my account for the first time in 2018. Hardly used it at all. Uh, it was only two years and a half later that I started to use it a little bit more seriously. And I hope to use it 
uh, a lot more from now because I find it to be really exciting. It's uh, not that difficult to use if you don't mind the, uh, 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 if you can understand Bahasa Malaysia quite, quite easily, then it's not a problem. But that's also the reason why I did this in English because when I started using OnPay.my, I was selling uh, my online events, uh, my uh, live events, my digital products were all in English as well. So that is quite workable still, okay? So you will notice at the right hand side here, let me just zoom in a little bit. Package, the name of the package that I'm currently subscribed to is called Light Dropship. So this is about 120 ringgit a month. Um, you probably got to see something called Pachuma for starters. That means you're using a free account. And uh, like I said, you can start off using for free, but do understand that there'll be some features that are not available to a free account that would be otherwise available to a upgraded account, all right? And uh, when you go check it out, which I might talk a little bit more in another video, uh, the different types of packages, but if I'm gonna give you a short answer right now, for most uh, average users, I think a 90 ringgit a month light package is already good enough. Okay, so they offer a 90 ringgit a month and if you want to save a little bit more, they have a three month and a six month uh, package with a slight discount, okay? But again, let's just start this off for free at the moment and when you see a fit for using this, you can start upgrading and uh, you can pay as you use. That means to say that whenever you want to use it, you can pay the, the monthly subscription and then you can just continue, all right? That's pretty much what it is and yeah, signing up for an account is rather easy. Uh, what you can do is that you can go below this video, there's a link, um, that's my recommendation link on how to get into OnPay, go through it, and then you'll be able to open your account, all right? So that's all there is to it, it's actually very easy. So what I'm gonna do next in another video is that I'm gonna show you how to start uh, configuring your setup and uh, uh, how to start adding your first product, okay? So I'll talk to you in another video.